What is going on YouTube? This is Nick with Hilltop TCG back again with another video. So today you guys, another one of my favorite things to do. Um, you've seen it a few times on the channel already, a little comparison, a little battle video. So today I want to test out who has the better hits. We got a booster box of Evolving Skies and I have four Elite Trainer boxes. So both arts. Both arts, I got four of them. So we're going to have 32 packs out of the ETBs, 36 packs out of the booster box. So obviously the booster box has a few more packs. So let's talk about pricing first off and would it even be worth it to go buy four ETBs instead of a booster box. Um, before I get to that, don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to us on YouTube if you feel like it. We really appreciate it. Check us out on Instagram at Hilltop TCG as well. And yeah, you guys, I appreciate it. So let's get into this. All right. So the booster box. Right now, we can talk about it two different ways. Pokemon Center, 145 bucks for a booster box if you want to buy it there. And ETB would be about 40 bucks. So you're 145, you'd be about $160 buying four ETBs, four or four less packs. But then you get the sleeves, you get the dividers, you get the coin. You get all that cool stuff in the ETB. So if you're looking for those sleeves, you're looking for that stuff for your set to put your, your hits in, all your cards in, so it might be worth it for at least one time to buy the ETBs instead of the booster box so you get that stuff. Um, current prices, it's right around about 150 bucks for a booster box. And right now I think these are around uh, $60, right? I think these are about 60 bucks for an ETB. So it's like $240 for four ETBs. So right now, current market, there's a bigger spread, and I definitely would probably want to snag the booster box, but maybe the ETBs have better hits. Um, on average, it's around two hits per ETB. I've watched a few videos, it's a little bit higher than that on average, I think, from what people are saying from an uh, average hit rate. I know the first one I ripped for an ETB, I got like two secret rare, so it was super sick. So maybe in the end, even if you get better hits, is it worth it for the ETB? All right, enough of my talking. I'm gonna start out with the booster box and then we'll move on to the ETBs. Let me know in the comments, you guys, what would you rather have? Uh, would you rather have four ETBs or a booster box? And these booster boxes, goodness, I love them and sometimes you hate them. Um, I've probably opened up three or four booster boxes now that have had like, four to five hits on average you get a pretty pretty good booster box but there's been a few my goodness they make you want to go cry home to mama <laughs> so hopefully we don't have one of those for this video because then that would uh, just be a pretty obvious blatant um oh let me give you, give you guys the code cards decision there i really i'm really interested to see obviously there is that slight price difference but is it worth it? And maybe some of you guys noticed I got this awesome Eevee play mat. I think this is a perfect play mat for Evolving Skies. Obviously, we have all the Eevee Lucians in Evolving Skies. So how fitting for this play mat. Thought it was perfect. Super fun. Got to make sure I'm <laughs> make sure I'm very careful with it with how white it is. I want to make sure I don't stain the play mat. All right. Three packs in. Nothing yet. That is okay. That just means we got some fire waiting for us, right? And we got a Gorgeist right there. Oh, code card. I'm I'm in the break mode. Got to got to hide the breaks for the codes for those on breaks. Cause like we ship out all those code cards. If you guys aren't aware, speaking of breaks, um, Skylar and I from Hilltop were uh, streaming or trying to stream at least three nights a week. Um, what am I doing here? I am, I'm taking out, oh, that's fun. Look at me going. Um, I'm taking out the, the rare and the, the reverse. I'm just talking to myself. Uh, we are streaming three times a week on average right now on, on Twitch. So if you guys are bored, go check us out on Twitch. We do pack breaks. We have them live on the website. Typically we'll try to update it the day we are doing the breaks because they, they do go really fast. Um, for product typically. 
So you guys kind of got to be on the ball. There we go. We got a first hit right there. Sweet coon. Okay, we are on the board. I feel better. We are on the board. I did a little uh, hit collage video um, of the of our first few, or I guess our last few breaks that we've done on Twitch. I definitely need to put together another video because we've done a few more breaks since then. I want to keep up the little the the hit videos rolling for you guys so you guys can sit back relax on youtube and uh watch just all the hits all the good hits that we get for people on twitch all right box all right we've seen some hollows we've seen some decent cards we've seen one hit we're about halfway through this left side i don't want to get worried yet we should hopefully have some fire coming. Appleton. There you go. Code card. All right. Come on. Come on, box. Let's get it. We got Drampa, the Grandpa, and an Alteria. Regular rare. Come on, baby. Let's get it. Ooh. There we go, Umbreon VMAX. There we go. All right, we got a VMAX on the board. Very pretty card. I love the Umbreon. That Umbreon is fantastic. I'm going to make sure to get a little sleeve in her. There we go. Okay. Come on, baby. Let's keep it up. Let's have this box be giving to us, huh? We need a good, we need a good comparison. I'm excited to rip the ETBs though, because I've had definitely a good experience with them so far. I've had definitely some very good hits out of the ETBs. Hopefully you guys have, have as well. Let me know in the comments what your uh, favorite hit been out of ETBs, if you guys have had a chance to rip some. Oh, baby. There we go. It's the first time I've seen this card. Look how off-centered it is. Holy cow. But that's amazing. We got the Neuvern V Alternate Art. That is what I'm talking about. Woohoohoo! All right, it is uh, just about as off-centered as you could get for a card. That is crazy. Look at that left border compared to the right. Is the same? Oh, the back's a little bit better, but not not as. Wow, that's that's off-centered. But we got an alternate art, you guys. There we go. No. No need to worry now, right? We can sit back, relax, and just enjoy the rest of these packs. We got a whole left half of the uh, box to go. Gosh, I keep not giving you guys code cards. There we go. Okay, two more packs on this right side. Let's get it. God, that Neuvern's super cool. I don't think I pulled that one myself. I think I've watched Skylar pull it on our breaks but i have not pulled that one myself that is amazing okay there we go okay last pack of this side oh all right this box is shaping up we got a leafy on v secret rare that is what i'm talking about Woohoo! we got an alternate art and a secret rare Leafeon. Oh, so good. That card is absolute fire. Okay. Well, there is a good, great first half of the box. Let's keep it rolling. Get these packs off my desk. Can we see something similar on this right side? I feel like we're blessed with a good box here. Let's keep it rolling. That Neuvern. The Batman, the Batman of Pokemon, I think people have called it. They want that Batman card, right? Oh, that's super fun. I've not looked at that up close. I still need to look at it up close. Yeah, that looks like Batman. That's fun. That's really cool. Really cool card. And we got a Secret Rare. The ETBs have a lot of pressure on them now. Those ETBs got to step it up. This box is making me excited to see what is in the ETBs. We got the luck today and hey, gar, gar not garbage can, Gyarados VMAX. 
So we got two V maxes. That is what I'm talking about. Gyarados up there. All right. Gyarados got a little glare in his eyeball. I'm gonna move him down a little bit. I don't wanna glare you guys out. I apologize for that. Let's see. Okay, so we got what five hits? Five hits. We just barely started on this right half. What else are we gonna see, you guys? Don't skip ahead. What do you guys think? What do you think? I say I'm gonna get greedy here. I'm gonna say we're gonna see one more full art. I'm gonna say one more full art and then the rest are V's. And I'm gonna say I'm gonna say two more V's and a full art. That's my prediction. Two more V's and a full art. Let's see if I am right. And that would be an amazing box. Two more just regular V's and then a full art. That would make for an excellent, excellent box. Grandpa the Grandpa. Was it from Never Ending Stories or something like that? It looks just like, <laughs> just like the dragon on that. Okay. Gigalith, regular rare. Come on, baby. I think between... I checked off all my all the I'll have a, a little ETB booklet and I check off all the hits that we've had from our streams and I think from our last stream we have uh, officially completed the Evolving Skies set obviously we shipped out all the cards to you guys but we've at least pulled them so we have our own personal collection going that I've uh, liked to track and that Neuvern, yeah, that Neuvern definitely has been on the list because Skyler pulled it. But it was kind of fun to track, to track my hits that we've had to complete our, our, uh, I guess, faux master set. All right, I mentioned a full art. There we go. We got a Metacham, and then we went on a dry spell. There we go. So we got one of the regular Vs. It's like we have about five more packs. Five more packs here. It still definitely happen. Is my prediction gonna hold true? Definitely have time for at least one more regular V. Can we get extra lucky? Alteria, regular rare. Four more packs. Come on, baby. And a wishy washy. Few people, I've read a few comments and they were. <laughs> Asking why I put the rare on the top. Oh, there we go. We got the full art. All right. We got a Golurk V full art. Um, I'll show you on a pack that we don't have a hit on it. There we go. So, okay. So now out of two packs, we just need a regular V. Is my prediction gonna hold? Is it gonna hold? Come on, baby. So yeah, I put the Talon Flame. So I just swipe over that and I put it on top. So the Talon Flame is on top because we give everybody the rares, the shiny stuff on our break, so it just helps me separate it all out. All right, last pack magic. Are we gonna get last pack magic? Come on, last pack magic. Ooh, nope, Seismitoad, regular rare. Okay, I was off by a V, that's a, that's a decent prediction. All right, okay, so we have uh, five, six, seven hits here. Seven fantastic hits, really. We have the Neuvern alternate art. We got Leafeon secret rare. I'd say this is a pretty solid, awesome box. All right, keep those hits in mind. Keep them in mind. And I guess I'll put I'll put I'll put Neuvern over there hiding in the shadows. A little little shadowy over there. It's mysterious. Neuvern is mysterious over there. All right, I'm gonna rip these open, you guys. It's gonna fast forward real fast and I'll be right back. All right, you guys, we are back. Okay, so again, these are the ETB packs. So we have four less packs. So can the four less packs pick up the slack or is it for sure more worth it? to go the booster box route. And again, I think if you're start if you're 
wanting to build the whole collection, you want to make sure you have sleeves for your uh, your set, I definitely would recommend. Oh my gosh. All right, ETB, you're picking it up. Umbreon V Alternate Art. Woohoo! I forgot what I was saying. Oh my gosh, you guys. How, oh, how fire is that card? That is clean looking too. Much better centering than the Noivern. Well, there we go, you guys. Let's start out with that. Holy cow. Holy cow. Okay, ETBs. Keep it up. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I have not pulled, this is the one card that we haven't pulled. That Now that I see it, that's the one alternate art we have not pulled. The Duraludon V alternate art. These ETBs are crazy, you guys. That is what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh. I don't know what to say. I, I mean, I guess I gotta keep opening. Holy cow. Okay, ETBs, maybe maybe they just got all the hits and all the fire. And I and, I, and I've opened up a, my fair share and I've only had one dud. All of them have been very giving. These ETBs have been very giving. So, maybe this will sway your guys' thinking in the comments here of what you'd rather go out and buy. Spend a little bit extra money on ETBs to get some fire hits. That's what I'm talking about. Woo! Oh my gosh, I, I, I'm, I'm getting caught staring at the board, wishy-washy. I would be 100% fine not pulling anything else out of these 32 packs. I mean, we're fine, we're good. I mean, obviously, we're gonna have some more hits, which is the most exciting part. What else are we gonna get? I mean, that'd be pretty boring for you guys to watch me rip 36 more packs and not get anything. There we go. Oh. That Duraludon. Woo! I got three alternate arts just chilling on this board staring at me. Let's go. Are you, you being for real, Pokemon? Let's go! Oh my gosh. I don't even know what to do with myself anymore. What is going on with this? I think, did I already set it down? I think I did. I'm trying to sort my bulk. Oh my gosh. What are we doing? This is okay. All right. What else do? What else can we get at this point? Right, we literally have opened. We're on our second ETB. I think that that was literally. I kept them in order. That was one ETB, you guys. That was one. That was one ETB. I think. How many packs we got left? Two, four, six, seven. Yeah, that first pack, that pack. Yeah, that was one ETB. How would you like that to be the one ETB you buy at Target or off our website or Walmart or whatever? Oh my gosh, that was one ETB. Okay, ETBs, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Woo, got hot. I got hot all of a sudden. I need to take this hoodie off. I'm freezing in the basement until I get some some fire hits out of Pokemon. Holy cow. Okay. All right. Enough with the holy cows. Just, I'll just gonna admire the board. All right. So, oh, geez. The second ETB has given us nothing so far. Gore guys, regular rare. Again, the typical hit ratio is, I think, like 2.2 .2 or something like that out of these ETBs, so you should expect to see two hits. There's a hit, there we go. Come on, SB on V, all right, we're, we're coming back down to earth now. We're coming back down, which is totally fine. <laughs> We've had some fire, all right, so out of these three packs, we're we gonna hold true to our typical ratio of at least two hits here. Come on, baby. I mean, I gotta ask for more because we have so many packs, and I just wanna I wanna show you guys what we get. But my goodness, that first ETB was absolutely insane. And we got a Thievel right there. Okay, last pack of the second ETB. These packs are just falling apart. 
or my fingers are too strong. Oh, okay. There we go. Suicune V. Okay, so that one was a little more, a little more Earth-like, a little, a little normal. So definitely average. So we saw our two hits. We're ahead by one now. Okay, third ECB. I don't think there's an ECB out there that could beat that first one. My goodness. Okay. First pack. We got an Apple Tune. Apple Tune. Second pack. We got a Rigekia. Relic. I can't. I can't ever pronounce that name. Don't judge. Just can't pronounce it. Not even gonna try. We got a Hollow. We got a Hollow. We'll go with that. Got the hollow. Okay, I wonder what the value is on the Umbreon and the Duraludon. I'm not not quite sure. I'd assume the Umbreon's fallen from grace a little bit, but I, I still genuinely have no idea on the price. I'd assume around maybe 50 bucks or so. I don't know, to be 100% honest. I think that Metal Energy is like $15 or so for a secret rare. All right, 30 TB. We're gonna have, we got two hollows. So, I mean, hollows do count as hits in the Pokemon world. People these days don't really want to see a hollow, they want to see that shiny shine. So, we have seen two hollows. So, that may have taken up our hits on this third booster box or oh, booster box ETB. Can we get something here? A Gigalith, regular rare. Come on, baby. We have one more pack after this. Oh, come on, come on, come on. And Sharpedo, regular rare. All right, last pack. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, nope, that was it. So we got a dud ETB. We get, we've had three, two, and zero. So will this last? Oh, okay, we got a hollow there. Is that gonna be one of our hit slots or true V hits or something you'd rather see than a hollow? Come on, last ETB. Show us something crazy again. Stormy Mountain, all right, we got like a $2 card there. I'll take it. I ripped these first two, I'd be stressed out. It'd be fun. It would have been way fun to end on that first box. That also relieves stress when you're opening up Pokemon cards to get a few good hits right off the bat. Come on, baby. Oh, nothing. All right. Our luck streak is slowing down. We got four packs left. Can we see two hits. Let's get our let's get our average here. Two hits. Oh, there's another hollow. Okay, are we gonna see the same thing here? We've seen two hollows out of this last ETB. Is that gonna be our hits? Come on, let's defy the odds here. An Ampharos. Nothing. Nothing crazy. Last two packs. Come on, give us something. Talonflame, regular rare. All right, last pack, can we get some last pack magic? Come on, come on, baby. Last pack magic. Ooh, okay, we got white, we got white. Let's slow roll this one. Come on, last pack, show us some love here. All right, skip the Skip the card there. I'll oh, skip another card. I'm not used to doing this. Come on. Where's the reverse? There it is. And all right, Volcarona. Okay, we ended with a base hit. Okay. So we got really lucky on one ETB. We got a, an average ETB. We got a dud ETB. And I'd probably say you wouldn't want to just get that out of an ETB either. So. Hmm, so we got six hits, you guys. Six hits, two of them alternate arts. Oh, so fire. Let's take a look at these up close. Oh my gosh. 
I'm so stoked. Woo -hoo -hoo. And then we have out of the booster box. I'd say those are our, our three highlights. We got Batman, Leafy on Secret Rare, and Golurk. All right, you guys, let me know in the comments. What would you rather have? What would you want to go spend your hard earned money on? Um, goodness. I would love just to spend 40 bucks or whatever and get these two alternate arts, but that's not guaranteed. Booster boxes have a little bit more of a guarantee on hits because you saw on the other ETBs, I mean, you got one, maybe two base Vs. So I think the booster box, in my opinion, is probably the safer route. We definitely got lucky there on the ETBs. But again, if you guys are looking to get the sleeves, to get the card dividers, to add to your set, I definitely would highly recommend going out and buying several of those as well and kind of doing your own makeshift booster box. And there was four less packs. Let's do, come on, let's get one more. Let's, let's make it even. Then we're gonna have one less pack here. One less pack. Have these just chill on the ground, giving me all the excuses to open up stuff. Okay, we got three more packs. I have a three pack blister. We're gonna go be even. We gotta add 12 bucks to our tally though. 12. <laughs> All right, there we go. Crystal Cave, Secret Rare. Okay, there we go. I'm happy. Goodness, okay, just go go add a go add a blister to your your ETB purchase, and then you're winning. Goodness. See, oh, there we go. SBMV. That's the fun part about like the ETBs and, and, and these three pack blisters is you don't, you're not guaranteed a secret rare, but you have an odds of maybe, maybe getting a few extra fun things like a, a booster box and typically would not give you two secret rares, two alternate arts, unless you got like the God booster box. So it is fun to have the chance at a different, we just went for a hat trick. That ETB literally had, th or that three pack blister had three hits in it. Flareon V. Wow, okay, that is an amazing way to end. All right, guys, again, let me know in the comments what you would rather have. I'm super happy on this rip. Absolute fire ended on a Flareon, perfect. Okay, everybody, uh, make sure to like this video. Please subscribe, it really helps us out and we appreciate the love. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram at HilltopTCG on there. Everybody have a great night, weekend, whatever it is for you. Peace.